What is up, Perfectly Average Golfers? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to Europe. Over the course of the next couple of videos, we will be playing in Poland, the Czech Republic, Austria, and Germany as I'm stationed in Katowice for some work. Getting things kicked off, our first round in Europe will be up in Warsaw at the first Warsaw Golf Club. Not necessarily a long course, but a tricky one. Let's get at it, let's have some fun, let's enjoy some European golf. What is up, Perfectly Average Golfers? I'm Alan with you guys. Let's get things kicked off at the first Warsaw Golf Club. Small caveat before we jump into this first par five. I did have the exposure setting up a little higher than I normally do. That does get fixed, so don't worry. It won't blind you for too long. But let's get at it. Hole number one, dead straightaway par five. A little bit of a carry over some marshlands on our second shot. Let's go. bunker trouble here we can't obviously go for the green so we're just taking 50 degree and getting the ball back into the fairway hopefully without catching the slip there we go good one all we can do with it yeah. oh long yeah. okay Get something on the green. Yeah. That'll work. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. All right, second hole up. Pretty straight away par four, but we have some trees blocking the majority of this landing space. So we're gonna take a four iron off the tee box, play something into the fairway, hopefully, and then have medium, medium wedge in. I think we're going to try to run one low. Oh. Okay. Almost. Oh, I put that tree there. It's kind of an impossible shot. I don't think I could have gotten a nine iron over to the top of it. Maybe, now that I'm looking at it, but that was almost a really good play. Just needed to be a little bit more left off the tee shot. We would have had a really good angle, but oh well, up and down for par. Hope you guys enjoyed this content. It's going to be a lot of fun for me to film, so hopefully you guys enjoyed it as well. Let's go. Sixty yard par three. We're gonna take eight iron. We're a little into the wind here, so a nice full one should be the right number. Let's keep it up. Turn. Oh. Okay. All right, we're gonna try to play this a little bit lower here. I'm not gonna take the 58. I got 54. I'm playing a little bump and run. Hopefully, right at about the fringe. Hopefully it kind of runs out a little bit. Should go right to left, so let's even give them close. Yep, that's exactly what we wanted to do. <sighs> that feels good. <laughs> Back-to-back -back pars, we have another par four. This is the number one handicap hole on the course. Um, the drive off the tee box could look a little funny from the camera's perspective because we have to kind of cut right near this tree that's off the tee box. Go straight away and then dog legs over to the left. Let's go. <laughs> I was afraid I was going to hit that tree. It's all right, yeah. <laughs> not, not much of an angle to miss the tree. <laughs> All right, we're gonna take a 54 degree here and try to get over these trees. I don't think we're fully gonna get to the green, but I do want to be up there and not back over this way. So let's see, good, good, good strong contact here. Well, caught the trees on the way down, but we'll take it. 
try to do the same thing we did with the 54, this time with the pitching wedge. See if we can just chip it up there, get it to run. Okay, a little long, but we take that. Dead straight. Okay, we've got about 220 yards. Sorry that the camera probably had you guys blinded. I didn't realize I had the exposure up so high. Uh, we got four iron here. We got a little helping wind, just gotta hit a good one. A little left, but we take it, hit well. Almost did it again. That's a long part three. Okay, good par, long part three right there. We have a big dog leg right par four. It's not a long one, but it does require us to take an iron off the tee box here. So we're going four iron straight over towards the bunkers. Should leave us a wedge in again. So here we go, let's keep in this four iron nice. More tree trouble. Another great four iron off the tee box blocked off by a tree. The pin's right behind this tree. We're gonna go 54 degree, we got 100, 115 yards or so into the wind. I'm gonna try to just see if we can maybe bend this back. I'm gonna start this over the cart path sign and hopefully it fades a little bit, but we're just looking to get on the green here. This is kind of crazy. Oh, it's right into it. Shoot. Almost. All right, still got a par look. Nope. Pain. All right, the trees are costing us a little bit. <laughs> There's some bad spots. We got a par four dead straight away. We got three wood out because the, the landing space gets really tight as we get nearer to those trees. So we're trying to split the difference. Three wood, hoping for about a 250, 260 shot here. Right towards the right bunker, we'll take that. That's not how we wanted that ball to fly. We'll see. Might be a little long. Slow down. Oof. Okay, another tricky part for this layout is keeping us guessing a little bit. Lots of shot making has to be happening off the tee box. We got driver out though. We're gonna go straight away. There's water and a big marshland over to the right. Then we eventually have to go right to get to the green. You can actually kind of see it way off there to the right from this camera view, I believe. So driver first, let's find out. much drop. All right, we're in play. We should have a knee angle, for an angle at this green. Got about 145 to cover the bunker. So I'm gonna take a nice full nine iron here. Should be about a 155 number for us. Hopefully get something right onto the flag. For a little left, I think that's fine. Just wanna make sure that we're not in that bunker is the biggest thing. Let's see. Yeah, we'll take that. Putt for birdie. Let's see if we can get one to drop here. Haven't been talking to the camera too much. I kind of had a uh, stupid moment. I left my normal camera batteries at home and I had to go pick up some new ones and I don't think they hold charge as well as my old my other ones do. But it looks like we should be fine to get a full round in with a little bit more talking to the camera. So I'm telling you, this series is gonna be cool. This is our first golf course we're playing, obviously. And then we've got Vienna golf and Prague golf and probably Berlin golf as well. So a little bit of an international journey for you guys. Hope you enjoy it. If you're enjoying so far, 
Make sure you sub on, follow along with the channel. Let's keep playing some decent golf. Let's go. Final hole in the front, that par five, mid 500s. Driver's out, we got bunkers along the right side. We're gonna try to keep playing for this draw though, so we're gonna maybe start the ball around that line, and hopefully it comes back to the left a little bit. Let's go. Good bounce back par. We've got a pretty long way to go here. We're gonna go straight towards these trees that we're seeing in the distance of three wood. I had a hard time getting a reading on what I need to do here, so I'm just gonna hopefully this is the right call. Oh, it's right under it. Go. Ah slid right under it. No, oh. that's not good. Messy, messy, messy. Oh, almost. All right, going to the back nine, hole 10, part three. I'm getting about 185 or so on the gun. We've got helping winds. So we're gonna take six iron. We're gonna try to draw something kind of over the dangling tree arms right into the pin, hopefully. So it's gonna start right a little bit, hopefully come back left. Let's go. Yeah. Keep drawing. Yeah. Okay. We'll take it. <laughs> ah, it's gotta hit it. Hmm. Oof. Okay, not the worst bogey, not the best bogey. Just didn't quite hit that first putt hard enough. We got a par four, pretty much dead straight away. It's not too long, so we should be able to get pretty close. We are into a headwind, so we've got driver out. Looking to kind of go, you may be able to see the bunkers on the right side. We're looking to just kind of start on that line. And again, draw things back, let's go. I never saw it. Left, eh? Was it? Yeah, I, I never saw it. The bunkers on the left. Okay. Oh no, didn't get up high enough. <laughs> Did some tree trimming. Let's try to get back on track here. I don't know if I mentioned it in the camera, but I probably put the text up that we did have to take an unplayable. So that was another bogey there. I think we're like eight over or something like that. Not great. We got a par five here for 12 straight away for the most part. I think this little dog leg to the right at the end with the green. So we're going driver. Let's hopefully see the ball off the club this time. Be in trouble. All right, we found her, but we got to punch and get out of here. Hopefully, real thick. Let's get the ball into play. There we go. That's all we could do with that. Just happy we found that one because this grass gets real thick. But the title is 12. Same ball we've been playing. But here's to being better lucky than good. Sometimes <laughs> we got to figure out what's going on, driver. This is getting a, it's getting a little out of hand. Honestly, getting a little out of hand. Big left misses, Haven't, hasn't happened in a long time. So, part five things though, third shot coming up. Keep the energy up. See if we can scramble together some pars, maybe get a birdie or two. Put together a decent score. Having fun. All right, front of the green's like 240. So we're gonna take seven wood. I just don't like three wood with this tight window here. So we're taking seven. Nice easy swing, if it gets there, it does. If it doesn't, not a big deal. There's water to the right actually as I'm looking at this. So, need to stay left here.
hope that rolled a little left because that was heading a little bit too far right for my liking. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna lie, I thought that seven wood was not gonna be on the green, so we like that. Par, now we go to par four. Straight away, 400 or so yards. We got driver, gotta hit straight. Let's go. Got the nice par. 165 here for this par three. Really cool, pretty look at the flag. Going eight iron, that's cool. Whoa, where's that going? Huh. Almost hosled it. Okay, I don't really know how to hit this down facing slope sand shot. We got 54, try to get it out. Uh, that is very tough. I'll sit. Ah. Oh, almost. See? Oh. Sloppy par three. Don't like making sixes there. Got a par four, another tricky one. Trees covering everything. We got five iron out to start off. Just hitting about a 190 shot. Should leave us about 140 or so in. Need a good piece of contact here. Get it in the fairway. Well, we should have hit much bigger club than five iron. We have about 200 yards to go. We are in the fairway. I got four iron for this shot. Nice and easy one. Just don't want to be short. Oh. Shoot. Right in the middle. Yep. All right. Obviously, I had to take a drop. Got 130, 50 degree. Got to get up and down for bogey. Good shot. What a bad putt. Oh, ah, man. All right, messy, 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 messy. Need to put something together here. Finish this one off. We have a part three playing about 190 yards to the pin. I gotta have five iron. We have a little bit of helping wind and there's lots of space behind this pin by the look of it. So it should be a good club. Let's hit it well. Second chance? Oh, I don't want to do. <sighs> Not great. Let's see if we can go birdie part of finish. We definitely can. Just gotta hit some good shots. Come on. Part five. See if this can give you a, this will be a birdie hole here. Got a tree right in the middle of the fairway. It's in range too, so we're gonna go right towards the tree because there's nowhere else to go besides towards that tree. So. Here we go. Driver's out. Let's see if we can just again think about hitting this a little fade. That'll be good. Okay. Okay, more tree things. We're gonna go four iron just to punch something low. Should be a still a pretty full swing, but I'm trying to flight this thing down. Ah. We like that. Super fantastic. <laughs> Super fantastic. <laughs> nope. Oh. 
These trees, man. It's always in the way. Trees are really costing us. <laughs> it's just, they're overhanging. And like, there's so many in the, in the middle of the fairway. And these fairways are already pretty tight. So, up and down. <laughs> For par, maybe. Sit. Ah, too much. All right, tricky final hole here for 18. It's also, I think, their signature based on the island green that we're gonna get. But the first shot, we have to kind of cut the corner and we're gonna take seven wood to do that. Otherwise, we'd have to hit like a nine iron into the corner and then hit a big wood and then hit a wedge in. So we're gonna try to cut the corner here. Well. Still okay, yeah? Off. Did I go over? Hmm. All right, drop. And we gotta sink this for par. Yeah, just didn't get left enough. Well, we got ourselves into a lot of trouble today. And honestly, I don't feel like I played as bad as the score is. 90 on the nose. Um, it's just those trees got in the way. We had to scramble and recover. We had some decent short game, some decent approaches, some decent drives. I think every part of the game was there at certain points, but it was never all the way there. So tough scenes overall, but again, this is gonna be a really fun series where we're just gonna go out and try to break 90 pretty much every single time we're out there. So lots of fun. That's the first from Warsaw. Definitely come out and check these guys if you happen to be in Poland. I don't know, what a weird outro. But no, coming up next, I believe we're gonna be trying to play the golf course in Katowice. Um, and then I think after that, we're gonna be in Prague and we'll play at least once maybe twice so pumped about it sub along for the journey if you guys are looking for more golf content around the world till next point make sure you perfectly average bye bye